104.7 The K, Mike the Intern in the studio this morning with Megan Buckbinder with the Celebrate Springfield, City of Spring. I mean, you wear a lot of hats, actually. <laughs> I, was, I was actually trying to figure out how I wanted to intro you. We yeah. actually served together on the uh, Arts Council, um, and that's how we met, right? Yep. Yeah, mm-hmm. If I remember correctly. Yeah, yeah, I think Either so. Either way, uh, that's not her professional gig. That's her... What do we call that? Civil duty? Yeah, uh, your passion project, yeah. whatever. People wrote me, <laughs> some of my friends wrote me into this, and right. now I'm going to do it because I'm friends with them. Either way, Celebrate <laughs> Springfield is a really cool deal. It's happening this weekend. Of course, mm-hmm. uh, there's a really big deal happening at Hammonds Field, right? Yep. Yeah, so Celebrate Springfield, this is our third year doing it. Um, it is a completely volunteer initiative that was created by Aaron D'Anastasio um, of the Hatch Foundation, and it was just basically to get people to love where they live, um, get community members not not only to be aware of what's going on, but then also to kind of remove some barriers that might hinder people from enjoying the community that we love and we live in. Um, and so the whole month of September, we've been promoting attractions and itineraries of things you can be doing mm-hmm. in, in all around Springfield, removing some barrier mo- monetary uh, barriers with coupons and discounts and things like that. It all comes to a head this Saturday at Hammonds Field, October 5th from 4 to 8 p.m. It's Springfield's biggest party. Um, it's completely free, family friendly you can come out there'll be live bands um dawson hollow is going to be performing um melody room another local band um we're actually gonna have the central high kilties there oh, as well great, which will be yeah. really fun um and you guys will be there djing yeah, yeah, got, um, which will be yeah coming. which will be really awesome and um uh, games and i think i want to i don't remember the number but at least 20 different vendors from around awesome. the community of attractions and that will have activities and there's food trucks and a beer garden. I mean, anything that you can think of. And it all culminate, obviously, with a big fireworks show at Hammonds Field. And it's right there all in the field, right? All, yeah, it's yeah, all in the Yeah, and if you've never been to an event like this at Hammonds Field, it's really cool because you can get down on the track, you yeah. can walk around, and with all those vendors and stuff through mm-hmm. it, it's like, for example, the Halloween stuff, it's always a blast. It's so because fun, you, yeah, yeah. You get to yeah. go down on that field. So. You never get that kind of perspective, and the Cardinals have been a huge mm-hmm. uh, a huge partner for us. This this is a completely volunteer-led thing, like I mentioned. Like So it's, it's all people just passionate about making sure sure that people get out and love our community and and have access this year's theme was attractions but in last year we did arts was um, our arts and cultural scene was our our focus last year and the year before that were the outdoors so um, every year we're trying to focus on uh, just another way um, for people to love where they live and and understand what's going on here if the fact that uh, you can actually still buy a house affordably in this community doesn't give you a reason to love it enough (laughs) thank you megan for reminding us why we love this community again if people want more info about what's happening Opening this weekend at Hammonds Field, where do they go? Celebrate SGF.com, or you can find us on Instagram or Facebook. Appreciate you. It's good to see you again. You too.